dedicated to Alejandro, my teacher, my mentor, who took me through the world of Shakespeare, broke me down, beat into me the presence of the pentameter, and then let me go. Thank you, Alejandro. One day we will smoke again at the table. Now is the winter of our discontent made glorious summer by the sun of York and all the clouds that lord upon our house in the deep bosom of the ocean, buried. Now are our brows bound with victorious wreaths, our bruised arms hung up, for monuments our stern alarums, changed to merry meetings, our dreadful marches to delightful pleasures. Grim-visaged war hath smoothed his wrinkled front, and now, instead of mounting barbed steeds to fright the souls of fearful adversaries, he capers nimbly in a lady's chamber to the lavicious pleasing of a lute. But I, that am not shape for sportive tricks, nor made to court an amorous looking glass, I that am rudely stamped, and want love's majesty to strut before a wanton, ambling nymph, I that am curtailed of this fair proportion, cheated of feature by dissembling nature, deformed, unfinished, Sent before my time into this breathing world, scarce half made up, and that so lamely and unfashionable that dogs bark at me as I halt by them. Why, I, in this weak piping time of peace, have no delight to pass away the time? unless to spy my shadow in the sun and discant on mine own deformity, and therefore, since I cannot prove a lover, to entertain these fair, well-spoken days, I am determined to prove a villain and hate the idle pleasures of these days. <laughs> 